we could not, in good conscience, use Fulton County taxpayer funds to make a payment. That's Fulton County Commission Chairman Rob Pitts giving an update just 24 hours ago on Fulton County's ongoing ransomware attack. Something we've been talking about in the newscast for quite some time now. It's now been four weeks since that attack with many questions remaining about when issues with the county systems will be fixed and what people worried about their personal information should be doing right now. 11 Alive's Grace King is taking a closer look for you. Chairman Rob Pitt says Fulton County is working around the clock on this ransomware attack. So here's what they've confirmed to 11 Alive so far. Pitt says neither the county nor anyone on its behalf paid that cyber criminal's ransom. But somehow Fulton County was removed from Lockbit's list of victims. Pitts doesn't know why that happens or what that means for your personal data. He says it'll take an extensive e-discovery process to determine what, if anything, was compromised. And that's why cyber experts say you should be proactive and start now. So first, think of the account information that you've given Fulton County, like your email or a password. The experts we spoke with recommend changing that email's password and any accounts where you use the same or similar credentials as you did for Fulton County. Now, second, determine whether you've made any financial transactions with the county. If you have, consider signing up for one of those services that monitor all of your credit bureau accounts. And finally, just be aware of what's going on. If you notice anything out of the ordinary, report it immediately to prevent any further damage. The data discovery process is tedious. It's time consuming and a lot of times uh, it does not even capture the entire information. So my advice is essentially just focus on or assume that your data is lost. And the key words there from Emory University professor Rajiv Garg, assume your data is lost. Garg tells me it could take Fulton County anywhere from weeks to years before they know who and what were affected. Grace, thank you so much for breaking that down. Still so many questions here. We are continuing to track the latest developments in this Fulton County ransomware attack to stay caught up on which services are back up and running and which ones aren't. Just text the word cyber attack to 404-885-7600. We'll send you that information straight to your phone.